from a primate capable of gliding up to 230 feet between trees to a sheep look-alike that battled back from the brink of extinction, today we look at animals you've probably never heard of. Number 14. Sulawesi Bear Cuscus Though it may have bear in its name, this thick-furred critter is actually a tree-dwelling marsupial native to the island of Sulawesi and other forests in Indonesia. The 15 to 20 pound Sulawesi Bear Cuscus can grow to a length of 2 feet on average and has a tail that will measure close to the same length. These herbivorous mammals live in groups of two to four individuals, keeping adolescents safe in natural pouch as the vulnerable species slowly scours for leaves and flowers to consume. Number 13. Saiga antelope Checkered throughout the Eurasian steppe is the critically endangered Saiga antelope. While initially sought after for consumption due to the lamb-like texture and taste of Saiga meat, their horns have actually driven them to the point of being endangered. A traditional Chinese medicine relies on saiga antelope horns as a main ingredient, and poaching of the protected species remains a consistent problem, with the horns selling for thousands of dollars each on the black market. Number 12. Lowland Streaked Tenrec Shielded in a layer of black and yellow spines, the Lowland Streaked Tenrec is a shrew-like creature that lives within the tropical lowland rainforest of Madagascar. A subterranean species, this animal is equipped with elongated hands, special joints, and hairs specifically meant to aid in digging underground. The majority of their diet is composed of earthworms and will stamp on the soil before burrowing as a means of sparking greater worm activity. The spiky quills that adorn the body of the lowland streaked tenrec provide a defense mechanism by erecting and facing forward when confronted with a predator. In addition, the quills emit a sound when vibrating, which allows them to both communicate with family members about incoming threats as well as potentially deter predators in a manner similar to a rattlesnake. Number 11. Bat-Eared Fox The bat-eared fox is split into two subspecies, residing within two separate regions of Africa. The Virgudis subspecies makes its home on the eastern coast of the continent in nations like Ethiopia, Sudan, and Tanzania, while the Megalotus version can be seen along the southern tip of Africa in Zambia, Angola, and South Africa. These foxes prefer to hunt among short grasslands, filling their diet with ants, beetles, scorpions, crickets, and termites, the last of which tends to make up 80 to 90 percent of their diet. Number 10. Qual the meat-eating marsupial known as the qual is a furry nocturnal creature that populates Australia and New Guinea. There are six different species of qual and they range in size from 11 ounces to 15 pounds. For the most part, these creatures lead a reclusive life, seldom engaging in social activity outside of mating in the winter. Mothers can bear up to 18 pups at a time, but can typically only raise six to full adulthood. Number 9. Hummingbird Hawk Moth From Portugal to Japan, the strange hummingbird hawk moth spans the continents of Europe, Africa, and Asia. This small insect with a full-grown wingspan of 1.6 to 1.8 inches earns its name from the elongated 25 to 28 millimeter proboscis and the audible hovering it uses to feed on flowers, giving it a similar look to a hummingbird. These similarities are an example of what evolutionary biologists call convergent evolution, the occurrence of similar adaptations in separate species brought on by shared evolutionary needs and responding mutations. Number 8. Mexican Mole Lizard It might surprise you, but this pink, slithering, worm-like burrower isn't actually a worm, but rather a species of typically legless reptiles called Amphisbanians. The Mexican mole lizard is the exception to the rule, though, because of its strong five-toed forelegs that remain. These tiny creatures are typically just seven to nine inches long and a quarter of an inch wide. Their blunt snouts give them an advantage in burrowing as they delve underground through most of their one to two year lifespan. They will rise from their sandy homes during times of heavy rain or at night, but in dangerous situations, the Mexican mole lizard can choose to shed its tail and distract predators as it escapes back below the surface. 
Number seven, Dole, known by a plethora of names, such as the Asian wild dog, the Indian wild dog, the mountain wolf, or simply red dog. Dole is considered the official name of this canid species. Like other dogs and wolves, the dole is a social creature preferring to live in large collectives called clans, but without the strict hierarchy conventions of similar species. Though it now must compete against tigers and leopards for predatory dominance across Central, South, and Southeast Asia, scientists believe these animals once traversed regions like Europe and North America some 12 to 18,000 years ago. Number 6. Spiny Orb Weaver This genus of arachnid is notable for their broad spectrum of hardened, carapace-like abdomens, earning them nicknames such as the Thorn Spider, Kite Spider, and Star Spider. This natural decor of the Spiny Orb Weaver Spider is reserved exclusively for females, as males will lack the thorns and coloration of their counterparts. Though they may look intimidating, these creatures are harmless to humans. Number 5. Colugo A close relative to primates, colugos are also known by the colloquial name of flying lemurs and are the most capable of all gliding mammals known to man. Between their legs hang large flaps of skin that allow the creatures to travel by air up to 230 feet without dropping much in altitude. This is especially handy for the colugos as they will spend a vast majority of their life within trees. They don't get very large at an average weight of 2.2 to 4.4 pounds, aiding them in their aerial pursuits. But despite being well-developed for gliding, this species is notably terrible at climbing. Due to a lack of strength or opposable thumbs, these mammals must take their time hopping up the sides of trees, using their tiny sharp claws as climbing aids along the way. Number 4. Patagonian Mara Though on first glance, the Patagonian Mara might appear to be some sort of short-eared rabbit, it is in fact a large rodent that can be found throughout Argentina. On average, these stout creatures can grow to be around 30 inches long and weigh up to 35 pounds. Their long, muscular hindquarters contribute to their jackrabbit-esque demeanor. The feet of the Patagonian Mara are compact, though, almost resembling hooves, while their tail is short and hairless, a far cry from the typical tail of a hare. Number 3. Aardwolf Across eastern and southern Africa, a nocturnal animal by the name of the Aardwolf wanders the shrublands in search of its much smaller prey of choice, bugs. As an insectivorous species, this relative to the hyena subsists primarily on creatures like termites, slurping down as many as 250,000 individual insects in a night, thanks to their adhesive, proboscis-like tongue. Aardwolves appear similar to their striped hyena kin, yet much thinner and covered in a black-striped yellow coat of fur. This species is similar in stature to a medium-sized dog growing up to 31 inches long, sporting a tail between 7 inches and 1 foot in length, and weighing an average of 15 to 22 pounds. Number 2. Mangalitsa Pig The Hungarian Mangalitsa Pig is the result of years of breeding different Hungarian hogs with a Serbian breed and European wild boars. However, given its thick woolly coat, this pig may look more like it's been crossbred with a sheep. The name Mangalitsa means Hog with a lot of lard, an accurate name for these fat, heavy swine, often described as the Kobe beef equivalent to pork. While it has been in high demand in recent years, though, there was a time when the Mangalitsa pig almost went extinct. In the mid-20th century, as lard faced out of popularity as a cooking component and this species proved to yield very little lean meat, the value placed on them began to drop, causing many farmers to stop breeding them. By the 1990s, this pig population dropped down to just 198 total. But animal geneticists and farmers worked together over the next two decades to stabilize them. Number 1. Raccoon Dog Popularly referred to as the Tanuki, the raccoon dog of East Asia is a staple in Japanese folklore. Heralded as a yokai or supernatural being, the Bake Tanuki is said to be a shape-shifting, mischievous being and can be seen in Japanese literature and artwork dating back over a millennia. In the modern world, raccoon dogs can be found all across the Asian continent, from Russia and Korea to China and Vietnam. Closer related to foxes rather than American raccoons, 
These predatory canids can climb trees and must weather natural enemies such as wolves, lynxes, and birds of prey. Thank you.